Hi, I'm Wyatt, and welcome to the Crash Course of the Black Death. Basically, what the Black Death was is a, is a sickness that arrived in 1347 and spread all over the world, killing 60% of the world's population. It started when people gathered on the docks and were met by a surprise. Most sailors aboard the ships were dead, and those still alive were gravely ill and covered in black boils that oozed blood and pus. Today we know that the sailors got sick because of the fleas on the rats carried the disease. Over the span of the first five years, the ill sailor, after the ill sailors arrived, killed more than 20 million people. And in Europe at that time, that was one third of the population. When people sneezed back, back in this time, they knew that they were getting sick and the people around them would say, bless you. And this is where the term bless you actually came from. Priests refused to administer last rites, and shopkeepers even closed their stores out of fear that they would catch the sickness. Many people fled for the countryside, but even they could not escape the disease. It affected cows, sheep, goats, pigs, and chickens, as well as people. The people then did not understand the biology of the disease. They believed it was God's punishment because of the greed, blasphemy, heresy, fornication, and worldliness. So people tried to get God's forgiveness. A lot of infected in Italy went to an island called Pobeglia that was across from Venice. A doctor would take a sick person on a rowboat to the island, and the doctor would wear a raven mask with herbs in the in the beak. You could look at it like a filter or like the doctors use in the doctor's office or a hospital with with a lot of sick people. Will there be another breakout or epidemic? Most likely not. Because today's medicine is obviously way better than it was in the 1300s. But we still do see a case pop up from time to time. And if it's left untreated, then the, then the patient will for sure die. But now today we have the medicine that can easily get rid of it and keep the disease controlled around the people. So most likely there will never be another epidemic or breakout.